Happy Friday, Warriors. I hope you're having an amazing week. This week, there's three main daily motivations that I wanted to hit on, the first of which is from Denzel Washington. He was receiving an award, and it was part of his acceptance speech, talking about, without commitment, you'll never start. But more importantly, without consistency, you'll never finish. And you could take both of those words, consistency and commitment. What haven't you started yet that you need to make a commitment to? And it could be today, it could be this hour, it could be right after you watch this video. Make that commitment to start today. And then we're already getting through the first month of the year and that consistency of some of those goals you might have rolled out this year might be falling off or you might be completely off the tracks. Consistency takes you so far. For me, I don't think I'm special in any way other than I just will relentlessly show up. Daily motivations are going out every day. These videos are going to go out once a week. Podcasts go out once a week. It's not that I'm great at them. It's just that I'm consistent. And as the more consistency you show, the more skill set you're going to build and the further you'll get in your goals. And then the next one was about charisma and character, where my friend Steve shared that charisma gets your attention, but character keeps it. And I thought that was really profound. Charisma, being charismatic, that actually is a character trait. But if that's the only one you have, some of those relationships you built will most likely be on sand and not a firm foundation. You could think of a salesman that's, or a saleswoman that's very charismatic, but if you can't trust them, if you can't build a relationship with them, if, you're, if that person feels like they're only out for that one transaction, you're probably not going to do future business and it might turn into one, one and done type of relationships. And the same goes for leadership. If you're being charismatic to their face, but then you're gossiping behind their back, you know, that's going to be a shallow relationship. Um, and the last one was regarding the narrow road. And I've been doing a lot of reflection on what the narrow road means to me. And a big thing is staying on that narrow road. And, and the longer you stay on it, the more you understand why you're on it and you're seeing the blessings come from it. So I know it's challenging. Sometimes the bigger things you have cooking in your life, you could feel that pressure to get off that narrow road and some temptations or whatever that darkness may be in your life, my encouragement for you is to stay on the narrow road because it's worth it and you will see the blessing on the other side. You just don't know how much further down the road it is. Finish strong, Mountain Movers. I hope you have an amazing close to the week and a weekend.